Hi, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to add a video like your own video to an app. So for this uh, for this tutorial I'll be using this this uh, my video dot move. It goes like this. Hi, this is my sample video that I'll be using in the next tutorial. All right. So that's the video that I'll be using for this one. So I'm going to show you how to embed this in your app and not the one from YouTube because on um, the previous tutorial I think I showed you how to embed a video from YouTube but this one will be like the video that you have so create a Xcode project go single view application in the project name I'm gonna call this one um, my video tutorial and we're going to use iPhone, storyboard, and automatic reference counting. Click next and then create your project. And here in the My Video Tutorial project, select Build Faces. And then click on the link binary with libraries. And then select the, the media player, media there you go media player framework this is the one that you want just double click it and then your media framework gets added here and I like to keep all my frameworks together so just click it and drag it in your frameworks folder and in your storyboard oops let me look at this again okay and in your storyboard you're gonna have uh, I'm gonna have a button to play my movie, so I'm gonna find my button. Uh, there it is. So this one, I'm just gonna call it play button, and that's pretty much all we need. And in our view controller dot h, we're going to import the media media player slash media player dot h and we are going to make our connections from the button into into the view controller header file and I'm gonna call this play button play button is gonna be an action type will be ID event is touch up inside argument is sender and in your view controller header fi implementation file um, in the in the view controller we're gonna have an instance variable called MP MP movie player controller and I'm gonna call this MPC and we don't need to do anything in the view did load so in our play button we're gonna have a NS string for our for our, um, for our movie name so actually before I do that let me put the movie into my project first so right click on your project and then add file to my video tutorial and the file that I have is uh, from my desktop my video dot move so just uh, select that um, and make sure this is selected also copy items into destinations group folder select that and select my video tutorial um, make sure that's selected and then just click add and from there uh, we'll continue from our play button method so ns string I'm gonna call this string path and string path just do ns bundle main bundle because the movie is in our is in our project right here so that's the main bundle and then we're gonna say path for resource and it, path for resource of type Fa uh, path for resource will be our file name is my video of type and the, this type is mov so just type that and then do a ns url and I'm gonna call this url equal ns url Oops, NSURL file URL with path. 
and the path is the path that we've just created called string path and from there we just say mpc equals mp movie player controller uh, alec Um, Alec init. Oh no, this one is not Alec. Alec init with content URL. Here we go. And then our URL is the URL we've just created. And then from there we say MPC set movie source type. And for our movie source type, it's going to be an MP movie source type file there it is source type file and then from there we're gonna say self view add sub view and we're gonna add our MPC which is our uh, MP movie player controller um, actually not MPC MPC dot view Okay, so we're gonna add that on and we're gonna set MPC set full screen and we're gonna say yes. So when the play button is clicked, it's gonna it's gonna play the movie my my video dot move and it's gonna play it in full screen. So that this is a different way than the previous tutorial that I've showed you where you embed your video from YouTube. Because this one you actually own your file that you wanna play. And then from there, at the very last step, we just say MPC play. MPC play. And um, I think that should be all that we need to play. Let's see what our error is. Um, string path. Oh, I don't need two here. Alright, there we go. That is better. So let's run it. Run it on our iPhone simulator. See how it see if it plays. Alright, so there's our view there's our um our application hit play. Hi, this is my sample video that I'll be using in the next tutorial. Alright, and the same thing we can we can hit done and it'll, it'll escape back. Let's rotate it and try hit play one more time. Hi, this is my sample video that I'll be using in the next tutorial. Alright, so that's the end of this tutorial. So just add your media player frameworks to your frameworks and then drag whatever video you want into your into your into your um your project and then it, when we have a play button or whenever you want to activate your video, just have a button that does this. And then in the viewcontroller.h, don't forget to import media player and media player.h. So that's the end of this tutorial. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.